Hey there, everybody. Fett here, and welcome back to Fett Plays RimWorld Beta 18. You gonna open that door, Accio? Nope, don't care. Anyway, we have plasteel flooring all up in here. It's pretty darn awesome. Don't know if you knew about this. Dude, both of these have lined up quite a bit at this point. These quarries, I like them. I like them quite a bit. Got some shield generators up in this house. We got a mad guinea pig up in this house. A th it's a three-day-old guinea pig. How can it go manhunter? Anyway, <laughs> I guess that's going to happen. We also have a shield generator here, although we have it powered off in the meantime. I actually don't think we need it powered off, but we'll keep it powered off anyway. And we have... Yes. Yes. Also, why is this not rich soil? It is rich soil? Why does it look like rich soil? Something about it makes it look different. Anyway, maybe it's the heaters. Anyway, I'm just going to change this up just a little bit. Hope you don't mind. Boom. This all hay. In fact, uh, you know what we're going to do? We're just going to... Do this, we're gonna do this, we're gonna delete this, and then we're gonna go, uh, boop, boop. Dis all hay. Oh, okay, yes, I see how it's going now. No problem, you can't grow on the actual, uh, dirt. That's why. But that's fine. This works. How are we doing on heel root over here in, uh, Century City, by the way? 75 is pretty good. I'm not complaining. How you doing, uh, Dry Source 2? 75? Yeah, you're pretty good. Beardy upset Stoken three times in a row. Well, you gotta calm down, buddy. They already don't like us that much. Oh, even more components. I mean, we only have a thousand of them. Thanks for that great trade. Alright, once this is all dug up, we can actually put up the nuclear power plant down here. Stoken started a fight with Raynal because of an insult. You, uh... Was insulted by Reynold, drove Stoken into a rage, and she started fighting him. You've, um, you've made a mistake. I don't know how to tell you this, but, uh, Reynold struck you in the torso while smirking. You're trying to attack Reynold with your head? Reynold bashed Stoken, injuring her torso without emotion. Oh, was that a knife? Probably wasn't. Nope, you're trying to use your head. I mean, this is not working out for you. Yeah. Yeah. He's he's untouched. Don't F around with Reynold, okay? <laughs> he will mess you up. Marion? How you doing? Got a little bit of social skill. Oh, I've offended you. That's too bad. Probably exactly how we'd say it too. Anyway, did we do a trade with uh, the exotic goods trader? I believe we may have, but I don't remember what they had. I've got a little case of the flu, so I'm not really the best person to do the, do the trading. Beardy, why don't you talk to him real quick just to see what they have? Because I honestly don't remember. How you doing? You have guinea pigs? Yes, you do. You've got uh, components. I laugh. At you. You have five Glitter World Medicine. You don't have any Uranium. Oh, I have not traded with you yet. A Growing Neurotrainer Mech Serum. I, I mean, that's okay. I mean, it's neat. If we wanted to teach someone growing. Psychic Insanity Lance. You know what? Let's just, get, let's just let you do the trading. I'm sick. I don't need to get up out of bed. Agricultural, let's see, those are our auxiliaries, synthetic lungs, bionic spine is ours. I just realized we used our last uh, scyther blade to give Dino Buddy a tail. Now that that's necessarily a bad thing. I really wish someone would come packing uranium. Tribal's rugs, it's pretty neat. God King's throne. Eh, you don't really have much that we want. Take this rhino horn. Take these ibex horns. 
That's about it. You want some more guinea pigs? I'll keep Aladdin, I suppose. But we'll get rid of Coconut. Keep Xena and Atticus. Keep terrifying. Get 420. It's your own joke here. Feed these animals if you'd be so kind. All right. We've got plenty of boom wrap meat. We should be able to make some kibble now. You know what? Put bulk kibble at the top of the list. In fact, put both kibbles at the top of the list. And then butcher creature and then make bone marrow. Bone marrow's not that high a priority, but... Uh, yeah, we need to use some of this stuff. Beardy, God. Stoken just doesn't like you, okay? Making veggie kibble? Why aren't you making regular kibble? Do we not have enough boom rat meat? For nutrition worth? I guess we don't. Okay. Tell you what. Let's put in a make kibble. A regular one. Do until we have 200. Just like that. Put that under this one. And then... Find Angel. Angel, where'd you go? Do that. And then she'll eat a cheeseburger. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted. You guys want to buy some miniguns? Just saying, it's right here. Oh, okay. So someone else is going to work on it instead. But Decaf is at least making regular kibble. Which means our animals will eat. Okay. Good, good, good. Jolly well good. Why did you go from over here? <sighs> Whatever. As long as you're working on it, I'm fine. And then he goes to work on something else. That's okay. Putting this stuff down is important, too. 56 versus 42. Looks like he's going to be fine. How am I doing? 56 versus 39. I'm going to be finer than fine. Senpai is going to be even finer than fine than fine. Triple strike. Probably shouldn't be cooking, but 83 versus 45. Panda is pregnant. That's pretty great. Got some more hay harvested. That's pretty great as well. The only animals that are starving are those guinea pigs, so I think we're going to be fine there. This ferret has not been tamed yet, but we're working on it. And there we go. That's right. We're just going to rock this stuff up. Why is this? This is a dirt path. I get that. When did this become not dirt path? This all should have been dirt path. I'm a little confused, but whatever. Just grow us some freaking hay so we can throw it in our freaking animals. And then turn this into regular grass. And then put on your freaking light walk shirt. How are we doing on Devil Strand? 292. Five idle colonists? All over here. All nothing to do. You joking me? Your lives are so good. You got nothing to do. All right. Whatever. I guess. You guys terrify me. Try to figure out how to deal here. I mean, you know what? You got nothing to do, Shark Walker? I mean, now you got something to do, of course. You got dirt to clean. Uh, okay, Silvermane. You're going to try to tame this fair. You do that. Come on. Come on, man. You can do it. You should probably look at it if you're going to tame it. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. You got Stegosaurus meat. Mm-mm. You know you want it. Eat my meat. Terminator's giving birth. It's pretty great. And he has done it. Named her Tanya. Life's good. Stay in the, uh... Stay in the home area, please. My little ferret. All right. Draft. Come on. Let's go piss off some bugs because we're stupid. Either way, we got even more guinea pigs over here. And uh, we should be throwing down some food for them soon. Dude, Beardy. You're just not good at that. Okay, we got food over here. Yes, we do. We got food over here. And no animal starvation. Excellent. Uh, you all following Silvermane? Because you probably shouldn't. You know what? Yeah, you probably should. He could use the protection. 
All right, a little bit closer. That'll do. That'll do. Okay. Do your stuff, Silvermane. Right in the butt. It's that eagle-eyed, man. That's what it's about. Dude can't miss. Except when he does. But I mean... 42%. 17%. I mean, it's tiny. What do you expect here? 21%. Look, some of them are a little small, okay? Dude knocked its stomach out in one shot. Sorry, you didn't need that live, right? Could we get an angle to shoot the hives, I wonder? Oh! Whoa, that made him mad. All right, back off. Slowly back off. They're fast. They're fast, but we're faster. Not really, but... Eh, most of them are turning. Okay, they've turned. Shoot another one. One shot, one kill. Let's go. One shot, one kill. Let's go. 5.7. Target's lying down. That's not helping. Hmm. That one over there is covering. 6.3. 5.7. You actually have a slightly better chance to hit this one. Violet is pregnant. It's pretty great. Hmm. Let's go up here. This will give us a better angle to retreat anyway. All right. 12%. That's what I'm talking about. Percentage of the gods. Let's go. 50th time's the charm. He's done. He's going to do it. All right, I'm done with this. <laughs> Let's get on the mortar. I think this will hit. Mortar won't fire. because Okay. Why don't I just do the fucking hive? Duh. We should be able to destroy this hive without hitting the caskets. Also, excuse my language, but don't actually. You should call me out on it. Let me know what kind of a jerk I am. Your family cannot watch this anymore. Your child will be tainted. Tainted forever. Could have sworn I had more statues over here, but apparently not. All right, whatever. Whatever, I don't care anyway. I need to get over this flu so I can start research. Oh! Or that could happen. Thorgan. They all have some... Some sickness. They have, wow, they're all wearing artifact-level combat armor. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. And they're not going to be happy about us. And the worst part is, of course, that they're ignoring, you know, everything. Okay. Uh, not Jenny, because she's non-violent, but everyone else? Uh, this, oh, jeez! Uh, Silvermane, come here. Flick the switch. Meteorite hitting in Ragamuffin City. It gives us... Salt. Lovely. Uh, oh god, our animals, animals, animals. Uh, get into the. All of our animals should go into the animal area. And none of them should be fighting with us. I don't know what happened to Boar. 11 got caught out. 
on the outside. Happens to the best of us. Okay. Brad Zag, get on a gun complex. Memes, get ready. D Wright, get over here. Kampachi, I want you over here. Brexio, also over here. I don't know why these boars are over here. They're in a dangerous place. Let's actually keep those forbidden for now. Get out of here, boars. All right. Yeah, I don't need to keep them forbidden, I don't think. Okay. Erdy, with your shotgun, let's get you over here. Shark Walker. Everyone else is kind of get in line here. Shark Walker, you got a good gun here. Barm, let's get you over here where the melee goes. Damn thing got up. <laughs> okay. Actually, Barm, let's get you back on the mortar. Let's get this thing charged up. They're coming in here. They got an automatic shotgun, a smoothbore musket, converted bolt action rifle, and an automatic rifle. This one's probably the scariest one. But we they have great armor, but we have great defenses. So I think we'll be okay. Their apparel armor is seven? What? Oh, you know what? They're not wearing actual armor. They're wearing like... Oh, no, they are. They are. Okay, their armor is actually pretty good. I know there's somewhere gear. That's where you can see the armor. Yeah, 31, 39, 8, 8. That's okay. We got more... Brexio is actually not very well protected at all. We actually don't have better armor on anyone, but... Vasilla has the best armor. That's surprising. Ever protecting tunic, that's why. Yeah. Alright, they're gonna be taking on this embrasure first. You know what? This is actually a good good chance for Brexio to uh flex her melee muscles. She hasn't gotten to do that in a while. Hey, some gold. Actually, speaking of melee, hello, Crossroad. How you doing with your throwing axes? Give you something to throw. My ass. Bam. All right, Barm. Uh, you did shoot that. Where'd it go? Oh, you're still going after the... You know what? That's fine. We might as well take out the hive tonight since we're already here. All right. Brexio is one again. Let's face it, they don't really stand a chance against Brexio. Marjo has gotten back up. Throwing axes did a little bit of damage. What are you doing? You trying to run? You trying to leave? Well, so much for that. All right, go ahead and capture Crossroad. And then the rest of us, for the rest of us, well, first of all, there's Festivus. Second of all, let's come down this way. And we'll take on those that hive. All right, we can turn this off now. Kampachi, you're going to be good to go. Unforbid everything. All right, Brexio, you're not going to bleed out. I think you're pretty safe there. Your pain is pretty severe. But you're going to be fine. So throw this person in a prison. And then we'll let you go get healed up. Maybe we'll be able to save one of these Crypto Sleep Caskets. Not 100% sure though. Double barrel shotgun of passion, huh? I mean, we're tearing down the walls. I'll give you that much. But with those walls torn down that way, it's actually better to shoot from the fr from the top. Jenny, what are you doing way out here? Healing up pigs? Trade caravan from Arnhad and them is leaving. See you later. Alligators. Alright. How we doing, boys? Let's get over here. Let's do the do. Alright, I think we're good here, Barm. But we're going to wait that 30 seconds here for that to charge up. It's got four hours before it reproduces, so we should be pretty much a guarantee to victory here. 
Unless this thing decides to spring up. Alright, if we accidentally lose the casket, it's not the worst thing in the world. Nicely done, team. Alright. And these have all... I've assumed... I'm assuming these have all been opened. This is all ours now. There are many like it, but these ones are ours. Uh, yeah, it looks like they've been open. Let's go ahead and harvest the plast... Or, yeah, the plasteel, the steel, all that good stuff from it. And we're all good to go. Excellent job, team. Just gonna stand around, eat our meals, and get negative thoughts about having to eat without a table. Love it. Rexio, go heal up for the love of Pete. Farm, you're good to go, too. Thank you for the support. All right, when you're done with that, how about we go uh, rest until healed, please? Actually, go sleep in the better bed. There you go. She'll be fine. Quite a few dead bugs, some gold. And a lot of them had some components. In fact, I think all of them had some components on them. Uh, let's see, we got this guy in here. This... Slightly old guy. Teetaller, Butcher, Nudist. He's not even that good. Let's go ahead and take his armor. I mean, it's all artifacts. Some of it is a little bit damaged, but... You still can't really pass up on artifact armor. Alright, and over here, it looks like we're doing alright with the cleanup. It's looking good. I'm quite happy. Look at that. We got even more components and we got more of these freaking chunks. Which I'm not as happy about, but hey, what are you going to do? Beardy upset Santa. Dude, Beardy, you need to just stop. You're just making everyone mad. It's actually getting nuts here. Immunity's at 70. Immunity's at 69. Nice. Uh, triple strike's done. He has nothing to worry about. And I know someone else got, a couple of other people got it too, but we're, we've recovered so quickly. I think CS Senpai had it. 91, he's practically done as well. Dude, just sleeping on this bed for like a day practically cures it from you. Dismas, switch beds. You'll be done before before nightfall, probably. These deep quarries are nuts. It's it's free real estate. Basically free stuff. Because you don't even have to throw down deep drills or anything. I mean, you never know what you're going to get. Sometimes you get rock chunks, which is garbage. Sometimes you get pl components, which is beyond amazing. I haven't seen it drop any uranium yet, but I got my fingers crossed. Got a lot more hay over here, which is good. Oh, we got a little bit of animal starvation. A single duckling is starving over here. Bulk good ship. The ultimate transport company. It's the best. It's not over here, though. Man, poor Century City gets crapped on when it comes to traders. They get nothing. Let's go talk. Ugh. Nobody comes their way. Granted, they have far less to trade, so, you know, it kind of makes sense from that angle, but... Jeez. Did we get that other eyeball made for dinos? For Dino Buddy? Not yet. Okay. Speaking of Dino Buddy, there she is. She's doing all right. Audra, moving very quickly with this graphic novel. When did you lose an arm? Did I... Did I admit... Did I just forget about that? Audra's been writing with one arm this whole time. Not that that's an impossibility, but still. Let's, uh, bionic up an arm for her. What in the world? What in the world? Okay. The ultimate transport company. Have Oliver. Ghostface. Jessica Marquis. All can go. 
Let's see. I need to keep the hens. I need to keep all the adult... Not all the adult silkies, but a lot of them. So let's see. I have a five-year-old here. What's their life expectancy? Seven years? I can keep you for another two years. So I tell you what. Let's just... We'll sell you. We'll sell you five chicks. We'll keep yous. It'll be pretty great. Rest of our animals we pretty much keep. We have a lot of pandas. They have a lot of pandas for sale, too. They're, they're selling giraffes. Okay. Uh, we're not selling Dino Buddy. Don't even think about it. We don't really need to buy components. We only have uh, a thousand of them. I know it seems dangerous, but I think we'll be fine. They have dire wolf wool. That's pretty great. Let's see. Do we have anything else we'd want to sell? I'm not sure. They actually have more valuable hides than we do. They don't have uranium because, of course, they don't. They do have a buttload of plasteel, which is great. They also have smoke leaf buds and a lot of them. We have salt. We have salt we could dig out, too, because we got that meteorite full of it. Which we should probably dig out, now that I think about it. Let's see. We'll trade our usual, usual excuse me, tradables. Probably not going to trade away any wood. And yeah, that's about it. I mean, we could trade construction jackets if we wanted to. Some clothing that we're never going to wear. Just go get out of a colony. We don't need you. And then other than that, I mean, they have a Tinker Craft Chef hat. Food poisoning chance minus 10%. Hmm. Interesting. Cooking speed plus 20%? Wow. We need to make it so we can start wearing those. Shooting accuracy plus 5. Aiming time minus 5%. Movement speed goes down a little bit. Cloth infiltrator headgear. Interesting. Very interesting. Surgeon's headgear of labor. Oh, medical operation in 10 quality up by 15%. Science gaggles. I mean, you have some neat things. You also have a lot of hospital beds, I've noticed. A lot of hospital beds. <laughs> and a lot of right couches for some reason. Ooh. These are super muffalo beds. What's your cheapest super muffalo bed? The hemp one? Even it is at 200% immunity gain factor, dude. Yeah, I'm going to have to buy this. I don't care that it's shoddy. It's amazing. Hemp nano sheet hospital bed. If only it were more than normal. But yeah. Definitely have to take a muff bed. Alright. There it is. We'll go ahead and get rid of this regular bed. Actually, this one has art on it. Does this one? It does. Ew. There's one without art. Oh, this one's only good. Deconstruct it, please. And then somewhere in this colony, we have a muffalo bed. You can recognize it somewhere because it looks like a muffalo. <laughs> there it is. Hemp Super Muff Bed 9000. All right. So we need to get this deconstructed. Look, I'm going to live for two seconds, okay? Then I'm going to move this bed over there. Good. And then... I'll wait for Wellington to move this freaking thing. Wellington! Thank you for your help. And then this goes, I guess, right here. All right. It is slightly not as good as this one. The medical 10 quality offset's a little bit lower. I think the rest effect of this might be lower, too. But... Actually, rest effectiveness is higher. Surgery uh, effectiveness is lower, though. Anyway. 
it has its ups it has its downs it's a lot better for recovering and that's the important part so let's get it over there and we got apples too yes we do we got apples how about you pretty great we have a lot of hay over here now all of a sudden still have a duckling that's starving over here but we should have a lot more hay coming in soon should have actually we're pretty good on hay we should be making some kibble eventually it doesn't have to happen like right away just eventually Kimpachi working on the repairs here it's pretty great me working on this bed that I'm gonna go ahead and lay on soon prosthetic arm is done just have to bionic that sucker up we'll be good to go Sook is pregnant beardy doing beardy things there medical rest until healed yay I'm sleeping in a muffalo all right so that's good a little weird but good animal starvation is still bad 45 days worth of food that is three months in RimWorld time of course which is pretty darn good also we have this prisoner over here don't forget about that who we have stripped of stuff we should haul this urgently get it out of here there we go especially this these good helmets and things in fact if we ship those back to the eternity forge and got some more nano nanite vials we could go ahead and uh make all these legendary Whew. we could also make any of these legendary too i don't think they keep their like healing of protection i don't think they would keep that though unfortunately techno socks look <laughs> I, uh, t I mean, that's okay. It's cool. It's just they, they give you some interesting things. These bonuses. Make large sculptures complete. Sandra has done it. It's a limestone large sculpture. It is Vasilla marrying Barm. Sweet. Let's put that in here. You got to put that in here. It's called compassion number five. Because as we all know... Number five is the most compassionate number. Make more, please. Okay. Got six components and 350 steel just hanging out down here. Waiting to be used. All right, Dismas. How you feeling? 82 out of 49. And by out of, I mean versus. Senpai's practically done. I'm going to go ahead and unprioritize you. Let you get back to your life here. How am I doing? 79? Um, I'm actually not being prioritized here. So we're fine. We're good to go. Everyone's going to be cured of the flu. We're going to... We're so close to being able to build our nuclear power plant. I'm really looking forward to it. But that's okay. Some good things happened this episode. Over here, we took on basically a, a combat squad and some uh, some bugs. It was a good time was had by all, I would say. Thank you very much for watching this episode of That Plays RimWorld Beta 18. If you enjoyed it, make sure to let me know by giving a like. If you haven't already, feel free to subscribe for more. Until then, that's going to be it for this episode of That Plays RimWorld Beta 18. My name is That, and I will see you in the next video.